Hey guys, my name is Maximillionaire here. If you're familiar with the YouTube platform or you've been on YouTube for a very long time, then you're probably familiar with these things known as douche tubers. They're YouTubers who do pretty scummy things such as doing fake iPhone giveaways, always plugging in their merch in their videos as many times as they can, or just having misleading or clickbait thumbnails and titles. Now obviously we all know that these YouTubers are all across the platform, I don't need to name any of them, but we all know who I'm talking about. But I have found one YouTuber who is so scummy, so grotesque, it is imperative that we bring this YouTuber to the light and we bring it to attention. I'm talking about the one, the only, scum of YouTube, NNA Productions. And for those who don't know who I'm talking about, here's a preview of what he does on his channel. <laughs> Hello? Hello. Oh uh, who's this? I am Slender Man. Hello. You guys have to smash the like button. 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 Okay, 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 okay. I think we get the point. This isn't even scraping the bottom of the barrel of all the things he does on his channel. So I thought for this video, I'd be analyzing the whole channel of NNA Productions, which believe it or not, is actually going to be pretty easy to do considering every video is the same. So without further ado, here is the problem with NNA Productions. At the start of every video, he brings back a dead, dead, disgusting trend. He pretty much makes you in a position where you are legally obligated to smash the like button if he's able to spin a fidget spinner on an object for five to 10 seconds. If I spin the spider fidget spinner on this Fortnite shield portion for five seconds, you guys have to smash the like button. Yeah, guys, let's do this. Three, two, one. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Boom! Now you guys have to smash the like button. Whoa. Oh. Oh. Holy f Did you guys see that? What kind of manipulative conceptualism is that? Goodness gracious almighty. Now I have to smash the like button. What legal papers do I have to sign? After this, he does this very creepy and pedophilic voice where he just gets really close up to the microphone and he's just like, Why don't you join my free gift card giveaway? Smash the like button. Like, what the f are you doing, bro? And it's not even worth it because no one wins any of these iPhones, in case you guys didn't wonder. He's hosting an illegal giveaway, which not only is scummy as a YouTuber, but it's against the law. You can't host a giveaway and then tell people to follow all these steps, and then when they do follow these steps, they don't win anything from the giveaway. That's against the law, whether if you're doing it on a video or whether if you're doing it in real life, you're scamming people. And so it's not only an idiotic thing to do, but it's an illegal thing to do. The next part of this magnum opus of a video is where he tells us what he's going to do for that video between 1600 to 17,000 times. Brand new video, another day, another brand new. Cause on today's video we have a really insane video, all right guys? I know it's gonna be like so, so, so insane, all right guys? I know you guys will love it. So guys, on today's video, we are gonna be asking Momo your guys' questions at 3 a.m. as you want to ask guys, all right? So I just posted something on Instagram saying, guys, what should I ask Momo? And I got a bunch of questions from you guys that I'm gonna ask Momo, all right guys? It's going to be so insane. And we are gonna be doing it at 3 a.m., all right guys? For those who don't know what happens at 3 a.m., since the time where all the events and spirits come to earth, guys, and stay... Alright, once telling us his life story multiple times and making us want to contemplate suicide, we finally get to the main part of the video. But wait, there's a build up. He does this beautiful thing that Mozart wished he could have performed or composed in his music. He does what I like to identify 
as a dubstep dance. This beautiful creature known as NNA Productions does this in every one of his videos. He wants to build us up before we get to the juicy, beautiful, chunky, junk in the trunk portion of the video. If you would like to perform this ancient ritual he does, all you have to do is just dab through <laughs> to the right, give yourself CPR while moving your neck left and right like you're a turtle trying to put, poke its head out of its shell, and then all you have to do is just change the camera so that it's negative. And then, there you go. Bam! 1.5 million subscribers. And before this video starts, you know what time it is? <laughs> Is that all I need to do to become big on YouTube? Dance in front of the camera like a moron? I can do that. Yeah, yeah, I can do that. Hold on. Hangover. And look at the time. Look at the time, guys. It is 3:03 a.m. right now. And you guys, you guys won't actually believe this. Look at this, guys. I just came into WhatsApp. That's where Momo is. All right, guys. And look at this. Like she's actually online. I think she's talking to some other people. All right, guys. It is like, really creepy. Like she's actually talking to someone else right now. Yo, this is actually so insane. So the way he starts off his main concept in the video is stating to everyone that it's 3 a.m. in the morning and that he's talking to the character that he's supposed to be talking to so for in this video it'd be Momo and really all he tries to do is hype you guys up a thousand times like yo guys I can't believe it this is insane we're actually talking to her right now this is insane this is gonna be so smash love. this is gonna be insane he says this is gonna be insane 15 times in a matter of 20 seconds like you're not gonna know what insane is until you do one of two things one listen to twisted insane or two watch one of NNA productions videos First question I'm gonna ask Momo is Boom, look at this guys. Do you know me? Alright, come on. Do you know me? Do you know me? Yo, come on. She's typing guys, as you guys can see. Yo, this is insane. Why did I ask these guys? Yo, please go down right now and smash that like button. This is creepy. Yo. Ha 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 ha. Of course I know you. Yo, guys, she actually knows me, huh? <laughs> How could you not hear of NNA Productions? Of course everyone's heard of NNA Productions. Everything you see, hear, live, and breathe is NNA Productions. NNA Productions is love. NNA Productions is life. When the people created YouTube back in 2005, they knew that a god was going to be sent amongst us. Us citizens, civilians, were going to witness a god on the YouTube platform. That god was NNA Productions. I'm actually starting my own religion. It's called Productionism, where all we do is we don't bathe, we don't clean, we don't shave. All we do is go on our hands and knees and pray to NNA Productions. He will cleanse us. He will remove all the filth. Okay, I'm getting off topic here. She's FaceTiming me. Look at Momo. Momo is actually FaceTiming me again. Yo, oh my God. Let's just answer it, come on. Yo, my phone is glitching out. Hello? Oh my god! Momo, is that you? Momo! Yo, I'm not going down there. Oh my god! Yo, I think she's down there. No, no, no. I'm not gonna go there. That's it. Wait, what? She's FaceTiming me again! Look at this guy! She's FaceTiming again! Yo, I'm not gonna answer it because I'm gonna decline it. Yo, that's it. Alright guys, I'm just gonna end the video right over here. Alright guys, so make sure to give a big thumbs up if you enjoyed. Subscribe if you're new. And don't forget notification to be on the notification squad guys. And I'll see you guys on the next video. Peace. Ah, Jesus. The f***? No need to hit me. So, yeah. Logic 2018. You're in danger by some demonic freaking bullcrap app demon. And the only way, the only way for him to save his life or stay alive is if you smash that like button, subscribe, turn on post notifications, and bam, just like that, tomorrow he'll be making the next video with the same concept. 
All he'll do is change one thing in the thumbnail and change the person he's talking to. So this was just a little video, I guess you could call it a rant video about this YouTuber that I just kind of have a problem with. Mostly because of the free iPhone giveaway, because that is a legal, that's an illegal act. That's a scam, you're scamming people, that I believe is a felonous charge. So, how he hasn't gotten in trouble yet, I don't know. I'm not going to notify authorities or anything, that's none of my business. But, I just wanted to make this video just showing you guys that there are people like this on YouTube who... I, b I believe he's self-aware at this point, because I'm pretty sure he knows that every one of his videos is the same. All I'm saying is don't fall for the free iPhone giveaways. I don't care how old you are. Well, I mean, unless you're under the age of 8, I don't think you're going to fall for any of those free iPhone giveaways. So, just be aware that there are people out there like this on YouTube. And I think that's it for this video. Hope you guys enjoyed. Please like, comment, subscribe, and, you know, turn on, po turn, on uh, turn on post notifications. And that's all. I'll see you guys around. Bye.